<laughs> Austin, what happened? <laughs> you guys, we're gone for a week and this is all you brought. What? <laughs> this is all you brought. Oh, for that's a week. all I need. <laughs> nothing more, nothing less. Here I come. Hi, mom. Hi, dad. Hi there. How you doing? <laughs> Going to pick out some snackies. Peanut brittle. Peanut brittle, <sighs> peanut M&M's, Swedish fish. All Ooh, the must. Swedish fish. <laughs> it's hot in here. It's very hot. Like really hot. <laughs> this is going to not be okay. Not okay. Ooh. <laughs> hey, show them, show them the mic count, show them the mic count. We're gonna play mic count this whole yeah, flight. Yeah, we're about to run it. Oh yeah, it's gonna be shit chill. Because of my sinuses, so Seb is going to give a room tour. <laughs> okay, welcome to our room tour. First off, we have a sliding door that goes into a bathroom. Inside this bathroom, you can see two beautiful sinks. Stunning. Some tissues for Sophie's nose. <laughs> oh, wow. Stuff here, yeah, it actually, it, you kind of jump to the point there, you kind of jump to the gun. Oh, <laughs> sorry. But, oh, wow. That's a big shower. Nice. Yeah, very nice, very nice. It's hidden here by this beautiful tile. Look at the tile. We have a little closet. Yeah, a little Steamer closet. for you, Sebby. Yeah. A little yeah. robe. Oh, look at the mirror, too. Huge mirror for you for getting ready. Perfect. Now we'll take you over to the bedroom. Over here first, we just have some essentials, some coffee, microwave. Safe. A fridge and a safe. Oh. We have someone at the door. Okay. Oh. Okay, surprise. We got our bags real it's quick. It's funny because I didn't even think about it, the, the toilets in here. Yeah. Austin was trying to tell us that the toilets are square. <laughs> That's not true. As you, as you can see here, the toilet is very much a normal shaped toilet. Um, we can close that now. In here we have the bedroom. King size bed. Beautiful bed. With some good lighting. A view into the bathroom. Big floor to ceiling mirror over here. And a cool little couch I thought Sophie would like. Um, a nice TV. It's interesting, a lot of these places have this on the window. It's like these dots. And I think it's just because it gets so hot, it stops a lot of the heat from traveling to the window. Would that make sense? Like, you know how cars have the netting? Yeah, maybe. Really cool place. Really excited. Yay. Very grateful to be invited here. Aww. I just look like I need to take a shower. <laughs> We are gonna meet our parents in their room and oh, walk down. Oh. And walk down and get dinner, I guess. It's like four, but we have been traveling for what? A while. 24 hours? Mm -hmm. No. Like 15 hours, 16 hours. I want some good Moroccan food right now. Yeah, we're gonna munch. Moroccan food is so bomb if you haven't had it. My mom makes such amazing Moroccan food. I'm excited to have Moroccan food in Morocco because I've never been here before. Moroccan food in Morocco. Yeah. Okay, see you at dinner. Thank you. Merci. That looks great. Thank you. Good morning, you guys. It's the next day and unfortunately, I woke up a little sicky, which you can kind of feel coming in yesterday's vlog. But last night we got dinner. We just walked to a restaurant that the hotel recommended and um, ate dinner there. Then we walked back and went to bed. We tried staying up as late as we could. So 
we could sleep throughout the whole night. We went to bed at eight and we woke up at what time? This is the white one. The white one. What time did we wake up at? Um, we woke up at, well, I mean, we had a couple of different times that we woke up at. No, but like to go downstairs for breakfast. Like eight-ish? Yeah, like eight. Eight. Cute, you look so cute. Thank you. Um, had breakfast and then Seb gave me a nice little massage and we watched TikTok. And now it's time to get ready for the day. Look how cute you look. So cute. You know what's funny? This kind of looks like a, a Jewish star, even though it's not. No, baby. <laughs> From like a distance. I love you, but no. Oh. <laughs> no. If you guys didn't know I'm Jewish, I'm Jewish. You probably didn't know that. T. Probably can't assume that. Oh. Okay, so the temperature is kind of different here. So we're spending three days in Casablanca and then three days in Marrakesh. And Marrakesh is like the Palm Springs of Morocco. So like, it'll be desert, desert. We're literally a block from the beach. So the temperature is so similar to home. Wouldn't you say? Um, yeah. Like, like 67? Yeah. So I'm just gonna put on some light makeup. I don't, you can hear my voice. I'm not feeling too good. I'm not feeling too hot. I think I'm just gonna wear jeans and a t-shirt, my most simple outfit. Um, we are going to where my dad was born. My dad was born in Morocco. I don't know if I said that, I feel like I did, but um, he was born here with, all eight of his siblings were born here and they all lived in one room. So we're going to go see that, which is going to be the craziest thing. Oh, cool it's already been such a culture shock being here, obviously. <laughs> but you guys, my dad is so cute. He's so happy to be here. You know, my dad, he's such a chicken nugget. So if you leave my jewelry here. Yeah, you don't need any. Also, we're going to the souks. Is that what they are called to be? The souks? Souks. Oh, the... Like the shopping center? <laughs> it's not a shopping center. Not a shopping center, but the market, basically. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Anyway. So if you didn't know, Sophie's dad speaks Arabic because he was born and raised here. He speaks eight languages. He yeah. Um, but we met our taxi driver on the way to the hotel yesterday, and they were just chatting it up. So we're using him as a driver the entire time we're in Casablanca. And he's actually going to walk us around and take us places and spend time with us. So we're excited. I wouldn't be surprised he if He invited us over for lunch. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if your dad invites him for lunch, too. We can all eat together. Oh, he probably for sure will. He seems like a really nice guy. And you guys, the it's driving nice here. Nice city. Wow. I have to get, Seb, you have to remind me to get clips of the driving. Yeah. It is so insane. Everyone just, like, there's no rules. And the yeah. cops are, like, encouraging everyone to just drive crazy because they just are saying, like, to go, 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 no traffic. It's crazy, crazy stuff. Okay, I'm gonna finish getting ready and then we are gonna head out for the day. The driver is getting here at 10 and it's like 9.40. It's 9.40? I think so. Okay, the lighting in the room is so bad. Um, let's pretend that these are the same color because I don't really want to just wear this because obviously I'm trying to get a little bit more covered up. So. I'm just gonna kind of wear it like this. And then just wearing denim and some Air Forces. Okay. Ready, Savvy? Mm -hmm. Wait, I wanna do your fit check. Well, my fit's not very special. I'm no, just, it's so cute. Come here. I'm just wearing a white baggy tee and some boots. You look so cute. Look at Squish. Is coming? No. Wow. <sighs> My dad gave me a cough drop, but it's kind of windy. So I'm just wearing Seb's hoodie <laughs> over my cute top and whatever. I'm gonna try to take a picture or we take like a family picture. I'm just gonna take off the hoodie. 
because it's cold and I'm sick and I'm not trying to be cold while we're walking around. Oh, teasing her, running to a house and hiding behind her. She was crazy. We were driving her crazy. I feel so stuffed up. Oh my god. We went back to the room. Um, they're all wearing like swim trunks, but um, I'm not. <laughs> I don't feel well. <laughs> well, obviously, I'm not wearing like a swimsuit because I don't feel well. But we are gonna just check out the beach area for a little and then go get lunch. lunch we walked back and um literally laid in bed for like what how long is that an hour and a half um, i forgot to tell you guys but yesterday we toured the sauna and like spa gym area and it was so nice and since i don't feel well we're gonna go use the steam room seb's gonna get a workout in <laughs> okay seb's gonna get a workout in and I'm going to do my PT exercises because I'm a good patient. Okay, okay, okay. that's enough. That's Sorry. Enough. Okay, love you. Love you more. <laughs> you guys, after the gym, we went into the steam room and it was my first time ever going in the steam room and it was so nice we showered and Seb and I laid in bed for like two hours now we're just going downstairs to the hotel restaurant for dinner because we're all feeling really tired <laughs> Seb thinks he's funny oh. <laughs> next one next one Full elevator I've ever seen in my entire life. You know what they say about full elevators? You know what they call them? Elevators that are full. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, down here for a little bit. Oh, yeah, you okay? You guys, I completely forgot to vlog at dinner. Why are you breathing like that? <laughs> It's breakfast time. Seb's still sleeping, but I couldn't keep sleeping. It's like 9 a.m. Oh. My brothers went out last night. How was it? They were closed. <laughs> <laughs> All that for nothing? Yeah. They keep saying this trip, they want a disco. Disco, disco. <laughs> Um, but we're gonna go to breakfast and the breakfast at the hotel is so good So I'm gonna show you because I forgot to show you guys it yesterday and you, and these Yeah, what well, what is it? You think we know? 
<laughs> Breakfast was so fire. Seb ended up waking up to meet us. We're going to head to the gym and do a quick lift. And then we are going to go to the zoo. It's about a 30 minute drive and they have a bunch of really cool African animals. And I've been wanting to actually go to the zoo with Seb for a bit and he's never been. No, I've been to a zoo when I was really young. So I don't really like, I don't really get a full grasp and I've never seen Amazon animals. Actually, I did go to the zoo in Singapore, but it was different. Yeah. Like I haven't seen a giraffe, I haven't seen a lion or a tiger or anything. Like yeah. Also, there's not that much to do here and it's also Ramadan. So that means um, a bunch of people here, like, how do I word this? Well, for Muslim religion, they can't, they're fasting. If you're a Muslim during Ramadan, they you fast during the day. You can only eat from 7 p.m. to 4 a.m. So also can't drink alcohol, so. And you can't drink alcohol. Oh. And it's not like this is a drinking city or party city anyways. Yes, yeah, so all the bars and clubs are closed. Most restaurants don't serve alcohol. So in terms the of- The only places alcohol. that are serving alcohol are the big hotels. So like the one we're staying at. And I feel like our only party would have been out here. So there really isn't much to do in a sense of like tourist wise. So that's why we're really excited for Marrakesh though. So we'll you guys, second. Marrakesh is gonna be so insane. We're staying at a Riyadh or Re yeah, Riyadh, which is basically like a Airbnb here, but it's like a villa. Like it's like insane. And we're gonna go on camels. We're gonna go maybe on a hot air balloon or in a hot air balloon. Yeah. And then maybe ATV through the desert. So. We go to Marrakesh tomorrow morning, and then we're there for three days, two nights, and then we're back here for the last day because the airport is by Casablanca. Marrakesh is like a three-hour drive or something like that. Okay, we're going to go in to the gym and get a quick lift, and I'll see you later. Spa and well, I guess just the pool area because this bar is upstairs. Little fit check for the zoo. I'm gonna be wrapped up like this. Look at mom's outfit. She's slaying. She got it at one of the markets yesterday. All the way back. <laughs> I don't remember the brand. Sebi. Hello. Say where everything's from. Five year old Air Force Ones. Perfect for Morocco. Patagonia pants from REI. Don't know where this is from, but shout out Nico. So cute. Uh, Wahoo. Whoop band. 
for running. And um, we couldn't find a lunch spot on the way home from the zoo because everything's closed because of Ramadan. So we ended up going to McDonald's and ate way too much. Why would you tell them? Two that? hours ago. Yeah, we should not have been to McDonald's, but now we have- The McChickens in Morocco are bigger than the McChickens and in the States. And they're so much the better. States. I don't know if they're better, but they're bigger. I thought it was better. But we have dinner right now and we're not hungry at all. But we have to eat. Okay. See you at dinner. Bye bye. Pubs and rice. <laughs> Some of this shit is not it. Some of it really good though. <laughs> I'm gonna ask this guy for coffee. So stupid. So stupid. You guys, me turning my phone around, you guys just ding dong ditched my brothers. Good morning, you guys, and happy Saturday. As always, we're in a rush. We are always in a rush, huh? Yeah. So we woke up a little late. We slept in a bit. We were supposed to work out, but Seb had coffee at dinner and he was wired. And when he's tired and I'm not, he tickles me, so I wake up so we can hang out. Oh, my love languages. He says his love language is tickling, you guys. How messed up is that? But anyways, we had breakfast with my parents and my brothers. And now we have 10 minutes to get ready, pack, and leave. Because our taxi driver is downstairs. We're going to Marrakesh and we're so pumped. Um, but I wanted to just get ready because I think we're going to go straight into the city in case our Airbnb isn't ready. And this is the spot I'm like most excited for this trip. Casablanca is really cool because it was so cool seeing where my dad is from. Um, but it's not very touristy. I thought it was going to be way more touristy. It's like not touristy at all. But also we're here, again, during Ramadan when not a lot of people come to Morocco anyways. Or like to travel anyways because there's barely anything open. Yes, I need to cut off these things as well. The tag in the back is still attached. Perfect. Um, fit check real quick. I don't have time to be doing this. Um, this top is the one I was talking about that in my last vlog that is a little cropped, but honestly, Marrakesh is more touristy. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. So I think it's fine. And then I'm wearing these linen pants. And then I got these shoes here, you guys. They're the New Balances in tan or like a beige. They're so cute. What up? Do you want to say hi? Toujour, toujour. Uh, toujour. Toujour, yeah. Toujour. Toujour. You Sunday, <laughs> you then day. Welcome to our Riyadh, I think that's how you say it, tour. This is the front door, look how stunning. She's massive. And also the birds chirping, sounds fake. Okay, downstairs is like the kitchen area, but I think we have cooks, I don't know. floor little seating area orange all the rooms have different color themes this is a room with two twin beds look at the shower like holy crap oh beautiful okay look it look in Wow. I think this is the room seven I actually put in. It's the only other room downstairs. Beautiful green. Stunning. Look at the details. And then my obvious favorite part. This. If I could take this sink home with me, I would. And then you guys, the shower. Whoa. Oh, you guys. Oh my gosh. And how insane is this? It's gorgeous. 
Now to upstairs. He will show you a nice form. Oh, yeah. Look at the ground. Black okay. and white ground, yeah. We'll show upstairs. <laughs> wow. Wow. My parents are sleeping in the pink room, I guess. They wanted. Cute. It's really cool. And then, you guys, look how insane this is. We can do it really quickly. Another. Cool. Similar to wow. ours. Wow. This is Austin's room. He called. Is there? Now, to the rooftop. Oh. So, this obviously shows the entire house. Look how insane. I'm obsessed with this. Nick, Nico said we need this for our rooftop battle. The big. And we're, I'm gonna be from 11.30 to four o'clock tomorrow, all day long. Wow. Also, you can see the Atlas Mountains right there. Way out there. So from this little bar area on the rooftop, we discovered a little kitchen, like a kitchenette. Oh, someone left bed for the birds. <laughs> How cute is that? Wow, look how stunning that looks. Look at their little stove and sink. Like, what? Seb's in the fridge. Sebby's hungry. Merci. back from the shops and it was so hot we had that drink at the little rooftop we were like we need to go to the pool immediately so i put on this little triangle bathing suit they come in bro. smile <laughs> go vertical go vertical this for my vlog <coughs> oh yeah welcome to morocco huh <laughs> how nice that oh that's not bad Oh. oh. Thanks, baby. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> there you go, sweet. Cheers. Thank you. Hey guys, it's a few hours later. Oh. <laughs> Oops. And we hung out on the rooftop for like 30. And then Seb and I showered and I just wanted to take off all my makeup. So I have nothing on. Did my skincare for the night. We had a late lunch, um, as you saw, and we got those drinks. Those were like our first drinks, I feel like. Like real drinks of the trip. Because as I mentioned earlier, it's a very religious country. So alcohol is not really a thing. But we've realized that rooftops have it. Interesting to see that like the more hidden the restaurant is since it's a rooftop all the rooftops like have it and we just had no clue so we figured it out but my brothers are hungry are you hungry i am yeah mm. the boys are hungry <laughs> as always so we're gonna go out to dinner and we didn't think we were gonna go out so i was just in sweats and i'm so tired <laughs> i just want to be comfy so i'm wearing Seb's shirt Seb, where's the shirt from uh, Wait, I'm with Dumb, Dumber, Dumbest. Dumb, Dummy, Dumber. Did you lock it? Yeah, we're on the move. Said it's locked. I don't believe it. The four of us are going out to dinner and we don't know where to go. So I think we're just going to the same place we had lunch. And I'm not that hungry, so I think I'm going to have Moroccan soup because Moroccan soup is 
so fire. Good morning and happy Sunday. We are, ooh, I can put my phone up right here. Uh, my brothers just went to go play golf and my mom and dad went into the Medina Souks area to pull out cash. Um, Seb and I are just gonna take advantage and tan. It's gonna be 96 degrees today. So we're trying to get a tan in before it gets too hot. I'm wearing this little top I got in my last vlog at that little boutique. And then I'm wearing my Emrata bathing suit in brown, They're like the same color brown. This is Sebby's fit check. What are you wearing? Same t-shirt I've worn for the past two days. And it goes bathing suit. We're gonna try to film some TikToks, so stay tuned. Great Chucky, great Chucky. Guys, this is freaking heaven. So nice. Did you show them the, up, the upstairs already? Yeah. There's a bar over there. We're lacking a bit of beer. That's no worry in the world because it's just me and Sophie out here and there's not a single cloud in the sky. It is so beautiful and I'm so relaxed. I told Sophie, if you see that little satellite over there, the little dish satellite. Yeah. Show them. Okay. We we have to get we have to get one of those for a decoration. Decoration? Yeah. No one text me, no one talk to me. <laughs> Look at her umbrella. So I propped it up so it was just my face in the shade so I could still tan. But I'm gonna have a more tan face than Sophie. You guys, Seb is going straight to Coachella. Not straight to it, because I get we get home Tuesday, and then I leave to Coachella. I have a client lunch on Thursday, and then we leave Thursday night. And then I gotta drive home Sunday night, because I have work on Monday, and I'm also working Friday. And I'm going up north to Lexi's baby shower Sophie's, this weekend. Sophie's taking care of responsibilities for both. <laughs> said said yes to Coachella first, but I no. selfishly wish he wasn't going so he could go up there with me, but to be fair though we're gonna hang out with Kirsten. I'm staying with Kirsten and Seb's family, which is fun. No, to be totally fair, if Beardo and Lexi had reached out prior to buying a Coachella ticket about the baby shower, I would have totally have committed to that. Yeah. But because what happened is I bought my Coachella ticket with my friends, which I wasn't even entirely sure I was going to go this year, but my brother was going and everyone was going. So I was like, all right, one more. Um, I bought my ticket and I was convincing Sophie to go. And while I was in the process of convincing Sophie, Lexi reached out to us. So that's why you were obviously like, we need to go to this, but I had already bought my ticket. So I was like, shit. So Sophie's, Sophie's going to go. I am going to miss out though, because I do really want to see Beardo. It's been a while since I've seen him. Um, I was luckily able to see Lexi recently when she was in the office in Orange County. But yeah, yeah, we're gonna be splitting up, but we spent the week together. Yeah. And I'll probably see you on Sunday. <laughs> yeah. Probably be in your bed <laughs> when you get home. Well, we're gonna relax and chill and we'll see you in a few hours. I look like I've just been in the sun for way too long. We're having a bottle of rosé mm -hmm. on the rooftop in the sunshine and I'm so excited. Some rosé. Rosé all day. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Mom. Cheers. Mm. Good. It's kind of dry. What do you think, Sean? I think it's fabulous. She's having beer. I'm having beer. <laughs> <laughs> that is too funny. All right, guys, quick little lunch bit. We're not done tanning because it's so hot here that it kind of is the only thing to do midday is to be in the pool. Um, so I'm just brushing out my hair. I put on this tank top from Brandy. I'm wearing these shorts um, from Princess Polly. They're longer shorts and then some Air Forces. I'm a tomato, actually we both are, but after lunch we showered and my parents got us these matching outfits. Should that I tell them where the, wait, why am I? Just tan and not burn. That we're wearing on, obviously I'm not wearing it yet, but we're wearing this on the camel ride. I got this from Zara. 
these from Zara. <laughs> They're not from Zara. They're literally handmade. Oh, you about to oh, more, hips, more hips, more hips, more hips. Yeah, you. We're all literally wearing the same thing. Yeah, guys. So I brought it too. Yay! I'm gonna give it to this camel. No, don't get it out yet. Mine's fully the back's breaking. Ah, yeah. I'm so sorry. Hold on. This is so gnarly. Hi, buddy. Don't do it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, that smells so good. I feel like we bought that. Let's go. Dajin, Burkok. Burkok? Alhamdul Burkok. <laughs> the outside sweet, the inside the is savory. <laughs> Guys, we have no clue what this is. <laughs> it's usually minced meat. You like that? With a. Like a... <laughs> he doesn't know how to act. You don't know if you like it until you're too deep. No, he hates it. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> so can you talk to you? Can you do this? It's not horrible. It's horrible. That's your thing. <laughs> I like it a lot. Austin, Austin just beer? smelt it first. No. <laughs> Walking through. Good morning. Happy Monday. We had breakfast and we're so sunburnt. It should be illegal. I'm wearing a top, just so you know. I'm not naked right now. Um, so they made us breakfast again and now we have an hour and a half till our driver takes us back to Casablanca. We have to go back to Casablanca because it's way closer to the airport from here and our flight takes off at 6.30 tomorrow morning. So we have to leave for the airport at like three. So we're staying at the hotel right next to the one we stayed at. Yes, or when we are in Casablanca, I guess. And um, we're gonna walk around the souks of Medina again. If you guys are here, you have to do that. You pretty much will probably do it every day. It's so cool and interesting. Um, so we're gonna walk around those and then come back here. We're leaving our stuff downstairs here. We're gonna walk around for an hour and a half, two hours-ish, come back here. Look at your toes in the background. Come back here um, and then we have a three hour car drive and I looked it up, I have bad news. Mm. Our flight to Paris is four hours. Guess how long our travel day is tomorrow? Total, mm. including layovers, including everything. Mm. Till we touch down in LA. Mm. 17 hours and three minutes. At least that's what I said yesterday when I searched. Uh, average flight home is 13 hours and 57 minutes, which makes sense if it's like an hour or so longer because it's such a long flight that the wind is making that Yeah. Okay. Wish us luck. Guys, we just scored a checkered rug. Obviously, it's like furry as you can tell, but it's on the other side. Got green and white. I'm so excited. I could not be more excited right now. Do you like it? Yeah, whatever. We made it. It was like a three, three and a half hour car ride, drive. 
back to Casablanca. We're really tired and we're going straight to the bar downstairs after this. I'm so burnt. And I'm so grumpy. You want me to tell the story then? So we had a driver that we first met when we came to Casablanca. I vlogged him. Oh yeah, so you guys will see him in the video. But he um, he was talking to Ami and he invited us to dinner the first the first day we got here. And we, we didn't think anything of it. We thought he was just being really nice. But on the last day before we left Marrakesh, he invited us to dinner again and we could tell he really meant it. And he wanted us all to come. So we're going to his place. You guys, place. he came to the, our hotel lobby in like a suit and tie. So cute. He's, so his wife, and I, I don't, we don't know <laughs> how much family he has. He could be living with his parents for all we know, or his kids as well. He but probably is living. A lot of people here live with their parents. And yeah. They care of the, their parents until they pass away. But he's setting up this whole dinner for us, and he's inviting all of us, all of Sophie's family and me, to a dinner at his place. And I guess they prepared everything, so we're going to go eat there. And he's in the lobby waiting for us to and finish he's... our bottle of wine, and we had to come up here and change really quickly because we looked very... Well, I haven't Chill. showered in like two days, so. I wish I, sh I showered last night, but I haven't showered since. So we put on little outfits. We put on this Princess Polly like Skims dupe um, top and then these cargos that I was wearing earlier and some Air Forces. Do you want to show what I have? Yeah. I'm literally just wearing a sweater and the pants that Ami got me and some Air Forces. But yeah, this is my way of looking nice. <laughs> I brought a really beautiful dress from Dish. And I'm so sad that I didn't end up wearing it. Because what? What is going on? We're just going to ignore that. I'm so sad that I didn't end up wearing it because I literally bought it for this trip. It's a full linen, like thick, beautiful dress. And it's a maxi dress. I didn't even wear it. <laughs> I was going to wear it tonight, but they don't have an iron. So I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> gonna be real, real casual. Oh my God, the wine in my teeth right now. Okay, anyways, my phone's gonna die. So I'm leaving it here. Um, whatever clips I get, I'm getting on Seb's phone. But it's the last night and we're having a home cooked Moroccan meal tonight. And we're excited. We're all really tired, but it'll be so fun. <laughs> 